Well, after a couple of weeks, finally got my new book. So let's do a new comic book haul. Okay, wait. So before we get started in the haul, uh, I don't know if you guys have ever watched towards the end after my credits thing. Sometimes I'll throw up a little extra thing there, like a blooper or just a random little shot. So nobody really comments on those, so I doubt you see them. But in the video you're about to see, I made a quick mistake. Quick mistake, that doesn't make sense. A, uh, a little mistake. Um, so I just want to correct that now. And that is with this book here, Invincible Iron Man number 11. I said that was the first reread, and that is wrong. That's incorrect. It did come out uh, recently, but that is not it, okay? Um, so I don't want to be giving out wrong information, and I really feel the need to correct myself, so I'm going to put that here um, versus at the end where somebody may not see it and just call me out on it. So um, that is it there, Iron Man 9, okay? That's the first, like, full one there. And then you got um, 7. This is the Woman of Power variant. And that's the first sort of cameo. I guess they call it that. So seven and nine are the two you would want to look for if you're going after the Riri stuff. Okay, all right, let's get into the haul. What's up everybody, I'm Jesse here. You're watching JLS Comics, thanks for coming back. Uh, this is a new comic book haul and I didn't realize till I got to the shop, I just got back actually, uh, that it's been a couple weeks since I've been there. Time certainly flies, so I got a couple books to show you, a few of them. Um, you know, definitely have seen before um, some some of the popular ones. Hot books of the week from the past couple weeks are in this pile right here. Um, but uh, you know, sometimes you just whatever life work gets in the way, and you just can't get out there. So that's what happened to me. So, um, anyways, a uh, nice little stack to show you new comics, um, but new comics of the past couple weeks. So we're gonna call this the early July new comic book haul. Sound like a plan? All right, let's get started. Uh, Paper Girls number seven. Uh, Cliff Chang, BKV, Brian K. Vaughn, issue number seven. Got Matt Wilson and uh, Mr. Fletcher on there as well. Uh, by Image Comics. Um, neat covers, how they're doing it with a big old splash of color and then, you know, the lettering. Um, complimentary to that. This is part two of two. And I guess they ran out because this is 2B for Lady Mechanica, The Lost Boys of West Abbey. Um, I believe it's just a two parter, so that's done now. Uh, Joe Benitez and uh, I don't know who that is Montel Montel Williams and then uh, Peter Stegerwald actually who is uh, you know he was working on what that Harley Quinn cover with uh, you know what's his face with Michael Turner's uh, company Aspen so check out the artwork in this if you haven't seen it it's really phenomenal it's really something else oh shit let me find another cool page for you. But that splash page is like, wow. See that? Really striking. Really great, great art in, in these books. I like it a lot. Um, so there's that. And it's different from this. This is a cool story. This is very, if you haven't read it, it's different. See how different it is? It's very reminiscent of, a, I would call it, a, I guess like a 1980s sort of uh, Steven Spielberg sci-fi type of thing. Um, it's really got that feel to it, so um, cool for both of those. And why is it so dark? Why is it dark? Okay, that's gonna have to do. All right, Mr. Solomon Grundy on the cover of Batman number two. And then we have a 935 for tech. And we have a 958 for action. That's a dope cover right there. I like that with the two of them, the red and the green. It's cool. Um, and then my other Harley book is number 29. That should be ending very soon. That's a cool cover. She's kind of like pressed up against it. I've seen some where, you know, some sketches where she's like pressed up against it. it looks like she's trying to crack through a CGC case and stuff. So this kind of has that same neat feel to it. So I don't know, it's neat. So there you go. Now let's uh, take a look at some of the old uh, Marvel books. Uncanny X-Men number 10. It's right here. Been good. Uh, I like it. I'm mostly getting it because it's, it's the uh, the Deadpool in there. The Deadpool. No, it's Deadpool in here. It's part of the team. So, it's interesting. Oh, look at that. 
Check out that last page. And Cap's like, no. That's neat. Doesn't give anything away, but it's neat. Gwenpool, numero tres. There with Modoc. Waiting on the bus. And then we have Deadpool v Gambit. Number one. I finally got these. This is another mini series. We've got a few mini series going on. So there's one and two. Okay, so I think I think it's a four parter, so that'll put us about halfway through. Um, these are really cool covers as well. This Charles Sewell story. Really like this one. And the artwork inside is phenomenal as well. Daredevil Punisher. And then check out the artwork in here. It's kind of like dark and gritty. I'm trying to find a good page for you. I don't know. That was a good page. Right, so that's cool. And then, of course, Daredevil Punisher number three has come out. So there's number three. So finish up that little mini series. It's cool, right? So the, on this one, you got Daredevil who's targeting the Punisher. And on this one, you got the Punisher scoping in on uh, Daredevil. So. All right, now let's get into a couple of these books that, uh, you know, people are uh, scrambling for. Actually, first, we'll do these. Spidey Deadpool, number six. You notice Joe Kelly is off of it now. It's Ackerman and Brown. But Joe Kelly will be coming back. They're just on for a couple issues. And then Spider-Gwen's at its first annual. So there you have that. All right, so hot books here. Miss Riri Williams. There's her book. I do have number number seven is the other one for this. Um, that everybody is trying to get and that um, is that the one? Um, you know she's flying around in her armor and stuff but um, really cool splash page here check that out it was number nine I don't know there was one where you know it was a women of power variant and stuff so I like that that's cool so the other one I got is number one five six for The Walking Dead. You hear the sirens. I live across from a fire station, so you'll hear those throughout my videos. Iron Spider, Mary Jane. Beautiful Alex Ross cover. Um, I have two other variant, or well, two variants for this in the mail, or ordered. One is in the mail, one is the Michael Turner. And then the other one from J. Scott Campbell uh, was delayed a week, so I should get the shipping notice for that. Um, Probably by Wednesday, I would guess. Maybe like late Wednesday. So, you know, towards the end of July, you'll, you'll see the other two variants for this pop up. Beautiful covers, but that cover A in and of itself is, is gorgeous. Um, and then the other one, the third and final, you guys have seen, but this was in my box, was Uncanny number 11. There you go, Mosaic. He's getting his own title. He's going to tie into some other stuff and yada, yada, yada. So there you go. That's my new books that I got today from the past couple of weeks. So did I miss anything? What you recommend? I know there's a few things that I, you know, trying to be a little bit selective with just, you know, because I'm trying to pick up some of the back issues and, you know, budgetary and all. I got to be fiscally responsible. Um, but I do have a... Um, video still I said it yesterday that I was going to do for the con putting that together and then of course the haul from the con itself um, and uh, I do want to say uh, on Tuesday is, is the next live show um, episode number two for comic conversation Tuesday um, so if you want to be on that I uh, have any ideas for it anything you want to hear uh, also let me know that down below your PM uh, you know message me over on Facebook on the JLS comics channel link is below and um, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll get that uh, worked out and sorted. So look forward to hearing all your comments and thoughts. Uh, look forward to uh, making the next video and the next haul. And uh, that should do it for today. This is Jesse here with JLS Comics, and I'll see you soon.